How's it going everybody Gaming Bear here. I hope your morning, day, night or whenever you are watching this video has been absolutely phenomenal thus far. For today we have our running back, the Clemson Tiger Hunter Hall, starting off the season 2-0, defeating the LSU Tigers and the Oregon Ducks. We do have 4 archetype boosts to put into our running back, putting him up to a 75 overall. And before we get into the video, I do want to express my gratitude and my appreciation to each and every one of you. This channel has started off oh so well, and we will always keep you up to date on this man's season stats. Every episode after the archetype boost, I will show you guys where he is at statistically as we continue our collegiate career throughout Madden NFL 20 and then when Madden NFL 21 releases we will declare ourselves for the NFL draft breaking a very nice little tackle or double tackle with a nice automatic spin move from Madden appreciate the little bailout and now you see Trevor Lawrence nice slant to Higgins going to miss this man after this freshman year because he is going to be eligible for the draft we will miss him like I said oh so much he's a big time receiver playmaker that will be a little costly to lose so we will need players to step up amongst ourselves we are a 75 overall now started at a 70 overall gonna do everything we can to hit the 85 to 90 overall mark by the time we finish our freshman year we want to be a dominant opposing figure to just completely instill fear in the opposing defenses. We want them to dread the matchup when they come across our schedule. These Texas Longhorns are definitely doing a good job about bottling up the run so far, but we definitely hope to bust off a couple, if not only one, humongous run in this game. We do have 90 speed, which isn't a tremendously high attribute rating, but in these collegiate rosters, it is definitely one of the higher caliber ratings, and we're hoping, like I said, to have it come into play. It is a 10 to 10 ball game. We are doing a very poor job about putting up points within this first half, but we will get a very nice seam streak for that first down. Running out of time, getting a sack once again, second and 23. Ross goes up and brings this one down for us to guarantee a field goal before the first half expires. The Longhorns will immediately retaliate with a field goal of their own, and that only gives our offense another chance to work down this field, kill some of this clock, and hopefully we can get a full 7 point touchdown lead. Because if our defense can come out and get a defensive stop, Hunter Hall goes back out there on offense. He's going to chew up as much clock as he possibly can, and that gives him the whole offensive spread of just continuously feeding him, getting as much as he possibly can. You know he is that bruising running back. He's going to take that one cut, feed you them shoulder pads, try to put you flat on your back as we are in the fourth quarter, down inside the red zone, just toting the rock, trying to get into the end zone, third and goal, just taking off. He splits the seam through the left tackle and left guard. Trevor Lawrence just making plays like he does. And I'm happy that we get that man for at least the first two seasons. He will, of course, become eligible for the NFL Draft after our sophomore year. And it's going to suck to lose him. But players, when you've got that great a talent, are, of course, going to have to leave and enter the NFL Draft. So we're hopefully going to put in our resume, put in another touchdown as we just did right here. And now these Texas Longhorns are in trouble up until they fight back. And now it's a five point lead and they strip the ball and get it back. We ultimately still win the ball game, but it just adds insult to injury when our last run of the day ends up being a strip fumble which has been the bane of our existence we will need to fix this issue with our play style if we want to be a highly drafted pick when the nfl draft comes but that is a long journey from where we are now 
Thank you for watching a Gaming Bear video. If you enjoyed, please go down below and hit the like button for me. Much appreciated. To follow the series or the channel in general, subscribe. And until next time, everybody, Gaming Bear out.